breaking news about Julian Assange by RT.com. The Ecuadorian Foreign Ministry says it has granted citizenship to Julian Assange. The reaction of the ministry comes one day after Quito reportedly issued an ID card to the WikiLeaks editor. The passport could provide Assange's uh, first step to obtaining diplomatic immunity as Ecuador wants to resolve his indefinite uh, embassy stay. The WikiLeaks founder has been holed up in the Ecuadorian embassy in London for five years. The UK Foreign Office reportedly rejected a request from Quito to grant the whistleblower diplomatic status after the passport was issued to him on December 12th. Extradition confidentiality, UK tribunal blocks release of uh, Assange files. Ecuador's foreign minister, Julie um, uh, Long, says uh, the country is seeking a dignified and just solution with the UK government over Assange's case. He added that Assange will not leave Ecuador's embassy while there are no security guarantees. A UK Foreign Office uh, spokesman said, according to the Express, the government of Ecuador recently requested diplomatic status for Mr. Assange here in the UK. The UK did not uh, grant that request, nor are we in talks with Ecuador on this matter. Ecuador knows that the way to resolve this issue is for Assange to leave the embassy to face justice. It comes after Assange posted a picture of himself uh, uh, in an Ecuadorian football uh, shirt aimed uh, amid uh, unconfirmed reports he had been issued an Ecuadorian passport. Ecuador usually issues such ID cards which are called cedulas uh, for people claiming residency uh, status. The Vienna Convention on Diplomatic Relations states that someone who holds a diplomatic passport is immune from prosecution. It is still no guarantee, however. Assange has been living inside the Ecuadorian embassy in London since 2012 when he was accused of sexual assault in Sweden. Although Swedish prosecutors have since dropped the case, British police remain outside the embassy ready to arrest the WikiLeaks co-founder for breaking his 2012 bail conditions. Assange refuses to surrender to the British authorities fearing they would extradite him to the United States where he expects to be prosecuted for his whistleblowing activities. Uh, yeah, I heard about that. I thought uh, Trump was going to pardon him and uh, the, the, the officials want his head on a platter, they're saying. Now let's see what happens. And I heard that uh, Russia was going to give him... Uh, um, citizenship there. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below and again thank you so much for watching.